We continue to follow that breaking news in DeKalb County where four people were killed as a plane crashed while taking off from DeKalb Peachtree Airport. And the airport now is just resuming flights this evening after stopping them for most of the afternoon. Our Doug Richards now is live at PDK right now. Doug, there were a, a number of people around the airport who witnessed the crash at that little restaurant that is there that's off the runway. They were, they were looking through the glass trying to surmise what was going on. Well, yes, you have the restaurant here at the airport. You also have a children's playground, uh, which is where we are, which is right at the foot of the control tower. Uh, and looking east across the two runways, uh, you can see what are curtains, which are kind of standard practice when there's a death investigation concealing the wreckage on the far side of the two runways. Uh, there's not much left there as the plane, plane tried to take off at 1.11 this afternoon. Uh, there were some photos taken by a professional photographer named Keith Berry, uh, who happened to be out here at the time when he saw the plane enter his viewfinder and then flip over. I was out just shooting. Actually, a plane that was on the, on the, uh, on the runway, and that's when you see the plane kind of bounce and flip over, because I couldn't believe what I saw. And I put the camera down, and then it flipped over, and it was... Just that quick it was on fire, just that quick. Barry says he watched, hoping to see people escape the wreckage, but unfortunately did not see anything. The NTSB says that the plane was a single engine Cessna P210, holds six people. Uh, the FAA says four were on board this plane, and the DeKalb Fire Department says all of them are fatalities. The National Transportation Safety Board uh, will take the lead on the investigation as to the cause of the accident. Uh, the weather here was clear and uh, a bit breezy, certainly, uh, at the time that the plane took off. Back mm. to you.